That is customized high quality uh, junk. Dude, customized high quality you know junk. You know, the only thing that's junk right here is your attitude. I disagree with that. Oh. Welcome to another episode of Play Camp. Today's Friday. We're looking into getting into a lot of fun today. We're going to be working on some sewer stuff. We're going to be putting Matt's floor back together. We got the jungle gym wrapped up and just uh, whatever else comes next. Right now, I got to go get some glue from the stores building. And Smith Blind and Owning is putting gutters behind my house. Don't forget to like and subscribe as well as watch the video all the way through because we're going to have so much fun. Sorry about that. That was a little extreme. Today is also a cool day because I get Pimp Chopper number two and number three back from the shop. Oh, I need someone to love me. This is a cool machine. Comes in as coal on this side. When you get over here on this side, comes out as gutter. With your swimsuit on. Oh, oh yeah, that, yeah. yeah. Forgot about that. Y'all have a pool back there? <laughs> that looks awesome. That is the most incredible children's jungle gym I've ever seen in my life. Joe, that's one thing I like about you is when you do it, you do it big, man. Go big or go home. That's what I'm talking about. Love me when Bro, what's up, man? What's up, buddy? We're yeah. chilling. Whoa, whoa, whoa. River, what are you doing, dude? We're oh, He's a narrow. Superman. Yeah. Hey, Mom, you're pretty. Check this out. Love me when Andy, can you give the vlog like some ideas on how to grow the, uh, such an excellent beard? You gotta, you gotta get a little <laughs> dirty to get it to grow. Walmart stuff don't work. Yeah, get a little mayonnaise. That's it. <laughs> All right, it's about noon, and I do have to get ready. Like I'm still in my like home clothes, so I gotta get ready for work. All right, I got my shower done. I got checks ready, and I, I went ahead and decided to stay casual, man. Just stay with some shorts. And it's Friday. Plus, if I put my work clothes on, I'm gonna actually have to work. We figured out what the water leak is. It is a wireless water leak. It's 2020. Everything's going wireless now. So we're just gonna go ahead and put the floor back. Fingers crossed, it's gonna be a wireless. Uh, finger finger crossing the deal. Wireless. Yeah. Wireless communications. Wireless water. Wireless water. Wireless Wi-Fi. Hey Tate, you need a wireless fishing rod. Some things will always be done the old-fashioned way. I'll be right back, y'all. Hey. Yeah, yeah. You come down here to the job, where you work, boots. What the? You gotta go to PM Hardware and get some hinges and some paint thinner. Love me when I know that last time we talked, you were kind of had that coronavirus stuff, and you're looking better. You're looking better. Good talk. Okay, see you later. Hey, Dominique, what you doing, bro? What is that? What? Bye, Dominique. Long time no see. You too, son. <laughs> yes, sir. I love this place, PM Hardware in West Monroe. This is not a sponsored video. Nobody's gonna pay me to make these videos. That's old Joe. I bet you a lot of people recognize him. He used to work at TP Outdoor for the longest time. How are we supposed to work with tools like this? That is customized high quality uh, junk. Dude, customized ju high quality you know junk. You know, the only thing that's junk right here is your attitude. I disagree with that. You don't know good tools when you see them. It's got duct tape on it. That is customized hand grip. It's, Look. it's blue tape and glue. Extra weight to the head. That's that, not extra weight. It's three pieces of duct tape because you slung the head off of it. But Tate, you don't understand the value of duct tape. That's your problem. No, I understand the value of duct tape, but not on a hammer. <laughs> You're just pissed off because it's not yours. <laughs> hey, Dad. What's taking so long? What? Is there any way y'all can hurry up a little bit? There's so air conditioning in here, I don't want to really get too rambunctious. <laughs> I don't blame you. Oh, I Cheers, Dad. To love me. Pow. Have a hell of a weekend. Oh, you too, boss. Rip them lips, man. Okay, I'm done with work. I got a really funny story I want to tell you guys. I was talking with the guys today, and I was kind of telling them the itinerary for the summer. You know, I'm going to go to Memphis here in a week or two, and then we're going to go uh, full wheel riding here at the end of August. You know, just doing different things. When I told them about where we're going to Memphis, it brought back an old memory, and it's just a really hey, look, funny story. Guys, I got money. Oh, look at this. Look at all this money. This proves I'm not very upside down at all. <laughs> when you first get married, you always hear a lot of times that the first few years are sort of the roughest, you know, that you, that you argue with your spouse a good bit. We absolutely experienced that. That was absolutely true for us. I don't even know what we were arguing about. I got mad at Leanne. She was mad at me. I got on the interstate and headed east. Okay, so I get to Vicksburg. I get, then I'm like, all right, I still am mad. I kept going, and then I got to this exit that said, this way to go to Memphis, and this way to go somewhere else. I went ahead and headed towards Memphis, and I told myself, at some point, I've, I've got to turn around. I'm not going to go all the way to Memphis. So lo and behold, I didn't turn around, and I went all the way to Memphis. And the funny thing was, by the time I got to Memphis, we had done worked our problem out, whatever the problem was. Was, and we were trying to get, a, get her up to Memphis. So I, I called them on their airport. I was like, y'all have a flight to Memphis like today. And they said, no, we don't. So what did I do? 
I sat down at Superior Grill on Beale Street and had a plate of barbecue. And I finished my plate of barbecue and bought a t-shirt for Leanne and got on the road back home. So we worked it out by the time I got to Memphis and as I, the farther I went south, the worse the argument got. And then by the time I got home, we hated each other again. It's just really funny the things you argue about when you first get married. You're living with a person that you never lived with before. You're getting used to their ways, they're getting used to your ways. It's kind of like for a little while until you get used to each other, I guess. Anyway, that's the fun story on with the vlog. What you doing, bro? Just running out this dirt. Oh yeah, it's a giant hole, man. Oh dude, that's cool. Hey, Calcute Video. Uh. Oh, I need someone to love me. Oh, you gotta get your coronavirus mask. Oh, sweet. Drone time. I'm telling you. I normally don't vlog this time of day on Friday, but I mean, we're going out to eat, and I feel like I need to get a little bit more filming done, so I'm gonna film. We're gonna go eat with the boys. I forgot my shoes. You forgot I your shoes? shoes on. Dude, you definitely gotta have shoes, bro. Oh, River, let me see your mask, dude. It matches your shirt. It says Sonic the Hedgehog. I love that, Bubba. All right, boys, let's go try out the new Twisted Cypress restaurant. All right, this is going to be a comprehensive review of the new restaurant, Twisted Cypress res restaurant, over here on the corner of Wallace and Cypress. Wallace Dean. Wallace Dean and Cypress. All right, boys, y'all ready yeah. to go eat? Okay. Judy, you feel like you're good? Uh huh. Oh, I need someone to love me. All right, turns out that's a bar, so I guess we're not gonna eat there. Okay, let's try this one more time. You're really taking this coronavirus serious, dude. Yeah. <laughs> okay, they require masks, so you have to walk in, and then when you get seated, or maybe even when you get your drink, you can take the mask off. Mom, you're cute with a mask. Thanks, Dad. You like the color? <laughs> yes, sir. Oh, I like your mask, pirate. <laughs> <laughs> All right, look at this. Oh, it's another pirate. <laughs> I just covered my face up. <laughs> I don't give this to many kids. They got only two sometimes. Oh, uh, I take them home. Oh, oh man, that's so nice. <laughs> I want to sit by you. You can sit right here. Love me when I'm... Okay, Mom, grade the chips and salsa. One to ten. Seven. Look, and I drawed my half. name it's on it. Bad. Okay, taste test. Dad, you remember three? <laughs> Love me when I'm Shrimp me ceviche, when I'm uh, portion size 1 to 10. 10, 12. Taste 1 to 10. 10. Water, how does the water go? 1 to 10. 10. <laughs> you gotta do the I love you challenge. I can do it. I love you. Love you. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Okay, we got the drone back, and the thing I love about DJI Repair is that like you might get a new drone, and then they might give you a repair drone. Most of the time, they give you a new drone, so let's check it out. It's a new drone, dude. Okay, this is the pimp drone. <laughs> dude, yeah, dude. If I wreck one, I can send one to the shop, and then I can have one that's operational. Oh, I need someone to love me. It is time for our wrestling session. We, we do practice wrestling here at the Nelson household, and what better age to learn than four, right? Oh, <laughs> oh, there you go, Judah. Legs up. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, having some technical difficulties with the drone. I can't really get it connected. I don't know what's going on with it. It's so weird I can fly it, but the camera doesn't come on and, and show through the display. I don't know. In the meantime, I'm going to sing you a cool Leonard Skinner song. This is the first song I ever learned how to play on the guitar. The reason I wanted to start playing guitar is because I wanted to be able to perform this song. It's called All I Can Do Is Write About It by Leonard Skinner.
episode of Clay Cam. Don't forget to like and subscribe. We'll see you tomorrow. Oh.